everyone, we are the Berry Girls, brought to you by Hen House Markets. And we've made it our life's goal to show you how to eat healthy and make, make it count. count. Welcome to the Berry Girls Kitchen. I'm Kylie. And I'm Linda. And today we're making it count by making some delicious tofu rangoons in our sizzling stir fry. Mmm, that's so delicious. Why get takeout when you can take it all in with this recipe? You're right. Taking all these nutrients and plant-based proteins. So instead of feeling sluggish and overloaded with sodium after you eat it, this dish is light, easy, and super satisfying. I can't wait for you all to try it. I can't wait to try it myself. So let's get started by preparing our extra firm tofu. Now tofu gets a bad rap for being bland and weird in texture, but after this, you will never look at it the same. That's Guaranteed. right. So let's start off with a mixing bowl, okay? From there, you'll put a cooling rack on top of that. You'll put the tofu on top of the cooling rack, mm -hmm along with a paper towel to help absorb some of the water. Place the skillet on top of there to help press down. We want to release as much fluid as possible, okay? Let's get it out of there. Once it's done, about 30 or 45 minutes, mm -hmm. you'll take it off. And this is the fun part you get to share with the kids, is that all of the water that's in there. Wow. You know, isn't that cool? You would not think it would be that it's much. so much going on here with the tofu. It really is. Good to know. Protein, all kinds of nutrients. I mean, make it count. So from there, we're going to set this to the side and then we'll come back. All right. So now we'll start working on the stir fry. Ooh. For this recipe, we'll be using textured vegetable protein, yes, also called TVP. Mm -hmm. So you'll start getting that mixed up. Sure. And I will cook the bulgur wheat according to package instructions. We all have our jobs to do. TVP is such a wonderful plant-based meat alternative. Even using it for sloppy joes, mm. tacos, hey, Yum. the kids will never know. Man, that smells so good. It almost has a nutty. It does. And with the price of meat these days, it's nice to have a nice alternative. So a couple of days of TVP and a couple of days of other types of meats would be awesome and That's very cost effective. Great idea. Let's get started on the stir fry. Over a medium heat skillet, we'll drizzle a bit of olive oil. And we have a bag of frozen stir fry blend, onions, Good. and we've got our Berry Girl sweet seasoning. So we'll put some of that on there. And it has lots of good stuff in there, including more protein. Protein equals weight loss. It protein does. equals weight loss. And muscle gain. All right, so we'll mix that up a little bit. We've got some soy sauce. We'll drizzle that over. And lastly, our teriyaki. Yummy. Sauce. That looks delicious. So you just mix this thoroughly over medium heat until everything cooks down and gets tender. All right, now we are ready to combine our TPP and bulgur wheat. So we'll first we'll start with the bulgur wheat and we will combine all of that. Now remember, this is just one cup of bulgur wheat, okay? All right, we'll get that mixed in and we will add our TVP, yes. our textured vegetable protein. It mimics the meat portion of the meal. So you're still getting all your nutrients, your protein, healthy carbs, great fiber, and you're making it count by a plant-based meat replacement. I love that, I love that. You can also crack in one egg, maybe two, to give you even more protein and make it count. Don't forget to add in a little bit more of soy sauce and teriyaki sauce. Make sure there's little to no sodium at all. Excellent. So now with the stir fry, we'll cover it and set it aside and work on our rangoons. Let's do it. So after the 30 to 45 minutes, look at the paper towel. Still. It's absorbed in liquid. So we're gonna put that to the side. We're gonna pick up our tofu, place it into the mixing bowl. You can fork it, or you can also use your hands to crumble it. It's really good you're showing how to work with tofu. So many people, including myself, have never worked with tofu. Yes, yes. It's a little intimidating. Yes. <laughs> now that we have it nice and broke down a little bit more, okay. we're gonna add in some onion. We're definitely gonna add in some chives, our delicious pineapple. Pineapple is gonna give it a nice sweet taste. You Yummy. know, with the ragoon, you get a little sweetness. So we're gonna mix it all and get it prepared to stuff into our wonton wraps. Do not forget the seasoning though. Have fun with your seasoning because this is where it's really going to count 
and the flavor department. Okay, we're gonna mix it in. Now let's get ready to stuff these. Okay. All right, so this can be a little tricky. There you go. Okay. All right, so then we'll dip, squeeze. Bring the ends together and squeeze and hold for a second. And you have to squeeze it just for a minute. If you would like to roll and tuck them, that's an awesome idea as well. Hey. There we go. They all get fried together. <laughs> <laughs> all right, now we'll go ahead and work on cooking these babies. You can either do it the traditional way on the stove with some oil, high heat tolerant oil though, and make sure it's either sunflower oil, toasted sesame oil, or even uh, canola oil works as well, okay? All right, so now we're going to make it count by cooking our rangoons in our air fryer. So before you put those in, you're going to brush it with an egg wash. They'll be cooked on about 380, mm -hmm. no more than three minutes. So about two to three minutes cooking, mm -hmm. no more than three at 380. There you have it, our delicious stir fry with our wonderful tofu ragoon. I cannot wait to try it. This is the best part. And I've got this with our dipping sauce, which is sweet and sour. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. That is delicious. Mm -hmm. I love how crispy and the tofu mimics yeah. the cream cheese. It's totally delicious. Berry girl approved. Exactly. Come back for more delicious and nutritious recipes from the Berry Girls. The Berry Girls are brought to you by Hen House Market. Berry Girls out. <laughs>